one of the lobby designs here, and uh, um, I'm bringing you a, another Cinema 4D uh, tutorial um, today, I guess, yeah, uh, whatever, um, and today it's going to be on FFD, otherwise known as, I think this is it, Freeform Deformer, pretty sure that's it, oh, I'm out of breath, what is, let's chuck my dog out, anyway, um, uh, so yeah, basically what this is, um, it is a, uh, it is a, it, it's a deformer, which, um, helps you deform things, um, a little bit more easily than bend and those things. It gives you a bit more diversity. Um, you can keyframe it, of course, um, so yeah, um, I'll put the, uh, grid points on 555, that'll give us, uh, no, wait, that, that's too many, I'll put it on 4. Right. So here we have these slices. Four slices, it kind of looks like a Rubik's Cube. Um, yeah, that's that's fun. Anyway, so yeah, there we have that. Now we'll get our cube. Now we'll start off with just a simple cube and we'll just make the FFD a child of the cube. Now, default, you would be in this selection mode, but uh, for this, you want to select FFD, then go to point mode, point selection mode, and click on that. Now what you'll be able to do is, on the FFD, click one of these black points, and when you drag it out, you'll see that the cube is affected. So you can see here that that corner of the cube has actually been strung out. Now, if I click on here, and I drag this a bit, I can move this around, and that'll change that. I can move this, oh, let's move it sideways, I can move that, I can basically move yeah, so it, it generalizes the deformation even though you're moving it from a point, but it still does a pretty good job. Um, I'll move that up. You can get some nice abstract shapes with this. Um, so, I mean, like, um, if we if you change the segments on the cube to maybe 444, that'll actually, um, it'll, I guess, be, actually, I'll change it to... 50, 50, 50. Now everything is a lot smoother. Um, you could use that for maybe if you wanted like to get a kind of liquid effect on a cube or something. Um, it looks kind of uh, looks kind of soft and gooey like a marshmallow. Um, don't know really how else to explain it, except that the sides here are sharp. Uh, but otherwise, I mean, you can see on the corners that if, um, if I actually change the corners, uh, that's sharp again. Pull that out. Da, da, da. Uh, yeah, so the, anyway, that's basically it. That's everything. Because um, that's all you need to know. Um, yeah, that's, that's uh, pretty much it. You can use this with any shape. Um, so if I just change it to a circle. And then I get FFD, make it a child, change the sphere segments to 100, I go to FFD, change that to 555, then click on an FFD thing, pull that, you can see that the sphere is affected. So yeah, um, maybe if I actually change the segments down, it will look a bit more... I don't know what it looks like, but anyway, um, so yeah, hope, hope you enjoy that, um, that was a pretty simple one, um, sorry I've been making videos much, I got Diablo 3, it's amazing, it's very fun, um, but yeah, hopefully I'll be putting out more videos, um, might put out a promo video or something, um, but yeah, hope you, uh, hope you enjoy, um, just, uh, tell me if you want something done, I would, prefer to get some money, I guess, um, because I'm, I'm getting a lot of requests and I'm really busy, um, even, even if it's just like three intros, because my computer is a tad underpowered, um, some of these intros, I basically have to do it and then render it, and I mean, if, if it's not good, that's like two days wasted and it's just, it's really annoying, so I prefer to only have about five, ten projects, I guess, a month, um, but yeah, so hopefully you guys all enjoy, like, um, subscribe, uh, if you could, 
thanks for uh, getting me up to 200. You can watch that video um, on my channel. Uh, download the uh, download the free intro uh, template, and I'll see you guys all later. So yeah, in, enjoy your stuff, and bye um, bye.